I'm Tiffany, and this is Towering TBR. Okay, so today I am doing a book tag that I was tagged in. Uh, Jennifer Loves Books is the one who tagged me, and the original is Spread Book Joy. I will link both of them down below in the description. The first question is, what you read? How has your taste in books evolved? So when I was a kid, I would typically reread a lot of times. I didn't pick up a lot of new books. I also, as a child, was very much only a realistic fiction type of reader. I didn't want to read anything that I thought was unbelievable. So for a long time, I didn't pick up science fiction or fantasy. Now I, I read most genres, including science fiction and fantasy. Science fiction is probably my favorite genre. I still have issues with unbelievable books like romance or thrillers. If something happens that's just coincidental, that probably wouldn't happen, that will sometimes make me not like a book. It has to be believable in whatever the rules are of, of the context. The second question is, has the format of your reading changed much? Yes. As a kid and teen and even in my early adult years, I would only read physical books. I don't think I got an e-reader until I was in college and I didn't really like it at first. It was not my favorite. But now I primarily re uh, rely on audiobooks. And I do read ebooks as well, and much less physical media. I, I primarily read with audiobooks. How much do you read? Do you read more or less than previously? I'll answer one of those at a time. So I read quite a lot. Um, currently, in the last five years or so, I've been reading about 100 books, uh, some more, some less, but I, I read a lot. I would say that as a kid, I, I read a lot, um, but once I was in college and in my early adult years, uh, I probably only read maybe three to five books a year. It was quite low, but in 2016, I participated in a challenge to read 52 books in a year, and I just barely made it that year. And then the next year, I joined a book club and found BookTube, and my reading has just exploded. How has booktube changed you as a reader? I definitely think that it, it's introduced me to a lot of types of books that I wouldn't have necessarily picked up. Good and bad. I, look, I read a lot of YA in the beginning because that was the majority of what the booktubers were talking about. Yeah, so I read YA. I read science fiction and fantasy. I started picking up nonfiction, which was a big change for me. My reading has just basically exploded since I found booktube. What actually changed my reading more than booktube though was the pandemic. I used to read a lot of literary fiction and while I still do, it's, it's often depressing and the pandemic has really created a desire for escapism, which I think is why I'm into science fiction and fantasy as much as I am right now. There's just too much real world depressing stuff like it's hard to it's hard to read about it so I think that's actually changed my reading taste the most. I've been watching booktube for like six years but I just started my channel last year and I think that that's also changed my reading. Sometimes previously I would probably pick up a meh rated book something that's you know three stars or something but now I just, I don't, I, do, I feel like I don't have time for math books. There are so many great books out there that I just want to find them and talk about them. And so I think that I am a little bit less willing to give a low rated book a chance. My, my reading has evolved quite a bit over the years. Oh, I missed the question, when do you read? I primarily read in the evenings, but basically anytime I feel up to doing, so I often do. It's my favorite hobby so much that I, I talk about it on, on YouTube. So I think so many people have been tagged in this already. I feel like I'm the last, but I will try and find some people who haven't been, or at least who haven't done it, and I will tag them down below. 
And if you're watching this and want to do this video, consider yourself tagged. Let me know how your reading has changed over the years. Thank you for joining. Bye.